this situation with Puff Daddy is heating up. There's, like I said, in order for them to really prosecute and get a, a conviction for Puff Daddy, they're going to have to bring out his accomplices because he had to have a lot of accomplices. There has to be a lot of people in cahoots with this, helping him, covering up things. <laughs> and one of those people that's been involved that, they, that they're allegedly saying that's on those tapes is Rick Ross. They're saying that Rick Ross was doing some nasty things and he's being accused by some witnesses behind the scenes that, that's mentioning him. You know, nowadays, anybody that was affiliated with Puffy, like I said, if you took pictures with him, if you was on a song with him, if you spoke to him walking down the street, you guilty of doing something. Everybody, anybody that's, anybody and everybody that was cool with this guy is looked at with a side eye right now. You know, so there's there's witnesses behind the scenes calling this stuff out. They're pointing fingers at to the who is who, which way to go, who to get this person, how to get this person. It's crazy right now. You know, um, there's one guy that's uh, that that was in police custody, and this guy is allegedly supposed to have been part of the freak offs that was going on, and he's blowing the whistle. He's doing a lot of snitching, and he's allegedly saying that Puffy. Uh, uh, Rick Ross and all these other guys are LGBTQ. This is what he's saying allegedly. He's saying this in the videos. Check this out. Combs. Puff Daddy. Yeah. P. Diddy, whatever you call it. So yeah. yeah, go ahead. I had sex with Cassie and Sean. Basically, he would, uh, he would masturbate and tell me what to do with Cassie. I was like a slave, okay? For them, that's what I was. That's all, all right? Um, I caught burpees and I came back and I seen him for the burpees and won. But Diddy said Ross, which they good buddies, okay? Mm -hmm. They 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 gay. Who? Both Diddy and Ross and Callan. They all gay. Okay? DJ Callan, Rick Ross yeah. and P Diddy. Yeah. They all gay. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. I seen the liquid cocaine. I'm trying to myself having sex with Diddy and Cassie. Okay, it's not good. He drinks it all the time. All right, he calls it GG. Let's lick with cocaine. All right. I've settled five, four point one to five million dollars with Diddy. Now listen, this thing is real crazy, real goofy. Now, now that's Jonathan Olden. This man was arrested in 2018 for a shootout at one of Trump's hotels. Now he was blowing the whistle on Puffy. And Rick Ross, way back then, before any of these so-called allegations came out, he was already telling. He was giving detailed, a detailed analysis and stories about what went on in those freak offs because he was a participator. Everybody thought it was a joke. Nobody took it serious. And I got, <laughs> and now, now this guy, he's like I said, he's locked up for something pretty serious, right? But when you go to look him up in, in, inside the prisons, you can't find him. He's MIA. He's all of a sudden just disappeared off the map. And we know that he has upcoming court cases, but you can't find this man. Why can't you find him? Because he's turned state evidence. He's now a witness to the Puff Daddy indictment. That's why you can't find him. So now he's implicating Rick Ross in those videos. And he's saying that Rick Ross and Puff Daddy had a, had a, had a, a sexual relationship. This is what he's alleging in those videos, right? And he's locked up for, for, for some really damning things, right? But he was speaking about this stuff six years ago when nobody took it serious, but now everybody's taking it serious. And we know that Puffy, Puffy and uh, Rick Ross was hanging together tough. They was old chums. They was cool, kicking it out together in the mansions, rolling, rolling hard, right? So now, with them hanging together like that, and now Puffy being indicted, and they saying that they, that they have these so-called freak-off videos, and you have witnesses saying that Rick Ross is involved, Rick Ross is in serious trouble. Serious trouble. Y'all remember this? Is that my brother? Yes. Homie Diddy in the mother promised land. Y'all know it's going down, man. We talking big money, big moves. This that 2022. I ain't gonna lie. Be talking like they getting money and like they got taste and they got style and savoir fair. But god damn, when God made this nigga here. And like I told y'all, 
This thing is real, it's getting real dangerous for Rick Ross because Jonathan Adi is not the only person that can tie him to this uh, criminal organization that uh, P. Diddy allegedly uh, created. You also have this top op in Tia, uh, Tia Kemp, his, his, uh, baby, his baby's mother. And she's been coming after him online for some time now. Really coming after him. And she's been blowing a whistle on a lot of stuff. And she's also talking about the freak off and a whole host of other things that can really get Rick Ross in some serious trouble. Man, this woman, this woman has a child by him and she's just online. These ain't young people. She's online acting the double dog fool. Like, check this out. Yeah, you big my Will, I want you to talk. Talk. Don't be scared now. No diddy, huh? You scared now, huh? I know y'all on them tapes. Freaky bitch. I know you is. Ten churn half It's time to show them churns now. I ain't gonna let off you. <laughs> you should have been shut this big mouth hole up. You know it. You know it. Sip your fruit, bad. You know what I like. Coconut water hole. Hole one. Drill a hole in it and put a cane straw in it for me. I'm mad right now. Can't hit me and my baby prom in two weeks. I'm finna go let out. Turn that down, man. Turn it down. It's quiet right now. What you quiet for? Nobody want to see your Louis outfits and sneakers. Nobody want to see it. Nobody don't care to see the Jets no more. You running out of holes now. Go over there and get Diddy a hug. Go ride the bike with him, you fat bitch. You know what time it is, prom time. You ain't sent the motherfucking message since December 9th, you big bag bitch. But I'm not finna play with you. I'm not. You gonna make me come to the gate, fat bitch. You been in Miami a lot, cause you ain't got no motions. It's slowing down. I heard, I heard you fat bitch. heard. I'ma get you, Will. I'ma get your I'ma get universe. Do your work on that big, big back. And if you keep sending motherfucking messages round, that's getting back to me. I'ma come over here and tell it all. You be told your to be towing next. You know what I'm talking about. This Tia Kent woman is crazy. You know, this is a woman supposed to have a child by Rick Ross, and she's like the baby mom from H E L L. You know, she's she was the one that when he was beefing with 50 Cent, uh, they convinced her to bring his son, Rick Ross's son, and put him in a 50 Cent video. Like, y'all see how she's carrying on online and everything. It's like she, it's, to me, it's like she's jealous of a baby father where she wants to be a star. Or she was upset because I guess he let her go when he came into stardom and, and he didn't involve her. Because she loves the cameras and the, and the limelight. And she's threatening to expose him anytime he doesn't do what she says, what she says do, she's going to expose him. She's going to drain the well. She's going to bring down his whole operation. This is what she's saying. She's saying that she got secrets on this guy and she's coming for him. She's online talking like this. I got it what you be saying. I'm going to tell Drake. I'm going to tell Dr. Dre. I'm going to tell Joe Button. I'm going to tell Charlemagne. I'm going to tell DJ, uh, 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 whoever academics is. I'm going to tell, uh. Uh, uh, all these people, Meat Mill, Meat Mill, you say you own your rights to the music and all that. Then you just did an interview where I say you don't own them. He said that nigga lying like a motherfucker. He said you sold your mama house and sent it to the slums. Is it true, Meeky? Because I ain't seen a picture of him and Meek put on that dusty ass album since. Yeah, he talked about Diddy. I got all the texts as a DM. I could put them up right now, but I won't. I'm saving them. For my bookie bookie wicka wicka took it. That's what's gonna make y'all buy. Em. So she's threatening to drop a tell all book. But that's I mean, but she's putting out all kinds of accusations that him and his brothers are allegedly supposed to have done. And she's online saying this. This is I'm listen to me. This is crazy. To me, this is like a very, very angry, disgruntled woman. And like I I'm like mental mental health issues, because this ain't normal. The way she's behaving is not normal. Right. They have a child together. Like when you hear her talk and she's talking about stuff that the brother allegedly supposed to have did things that Rick Ross has knowledge of. And if the feds come in on this and he was to get in trouble for this, he ain't never getting out. 
the things that she's alleging to the world online. She said she's not. She, she's mentioning she's naming names and mentioning names. The police is watching. They already got him on tapes. Listen to what she's saying now. So we fit a clock this T right here. Renee says you want to stay key. We fit to talk about some real T. Your brother over there paying people to put hits out. He over there paying people to put hits out and off with his money and it's getting back to me. So now, now I'm finna send the feds over there to y'all mother empire. See, you had the right. You keep playing with me off of the town. Next, we gonna talk about Miss Carol. Y'all know who Miss Carol is. You know that's behind your brother. I'm finna make sure her family sue y'all whole estate. Because that case is not closed. You know the lady leaving from my mama house, getting her hair done that time. And it's behind your brother and his drama. You know that. You know. You know. About the man who they, who, who front a black house. Okay. We finna dig up a whole bunch of kids right now, ho. I'm not finna play with you, you old zimpic. I'm finna finish y'all mother. Watch this. Now, I'm going to keep it all with 100. If she's saying that she can link him to unaliving un people, multiple people, he's in serious trouble. And I'm going to tell you something. The minute she went online and said this, when these indictments are coming down, the feds are coming for her. Because you know too much. You're revealing too much. She's online saying she's going to put something in the book. Wait a minute. If you have knowledge on the unaliving of people, and you want to put it in the book where you were an accomplice? So now you want to cash out off of this? No, no, that's not the way it operates. Right now, there's an indictment going down where there's an alleged that Rick Ross may be an, a part of those freak offs and may be a part of this crime, this RICO, right? Now, she's online alleging that she has knowledge to some unaliving. Uh, that Rick Ross's brother and Rick Ross may have had something to do with. And she also has knowledge of the freak offs so now the feds want to talk to you so now when they come talk to you about those so-called freak offs they also want to talk to you about those alleged unalivings of that woman that was coming from getting her hair getting her hair done the guy that was in front of such and such home that you're telling the world you're broadcasting to the world they want to know all of this miss kemp this is crazy man this is crazy this ain't and like i said this ain't normal this ain't like you just, she just online implicating unalivance. Let me know what y'all think, man. Rick Ross, man, is going, Rick Ross is on the verge of going down, man. The whole empire is just falling. I told you your idols must fall. <laughs> Listen, man, I mean, if you made it this far in the video, hit that like button. Subscribe to Street Media TV. Leave your comments in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think. Remember, I love y'all to the next time. Peace.